It's hot out there. Hello Redskins. I'm your host this week, Carson Fraunfelter. Before we do anything else, now let's go to Taylor with sports. Thank you, Carson. Last Friday, our Redskin boys took on the Solomon Gorillas. They fought hard, but ultimately lost. Tonight, they play the Gossel Bluebirds. Good luck, Redskins. Last Tuesday, the volleyball girls hosted a quad and played in two games. They lost to Gossel, but won against Wakefield. On Saturday, our volleyball girls traveled to Lions for a tournament. They gave it their all, but they couldn't bring home the W. We'll get them next time, Redskins. That's all for sports this week. And now, I'm going to give it to Jasmine with school news. Thank you, Carson. Our band went to perform at the Hutchinson State Fair. Here's a short video. As you all know, this week was Spirit Week. Here are this week's best outfits. tomorrow from 8 o'clock to 11 p.m. in the commons area. It is $3 single and $5 per couple. Dress code is jeans and a nice shirt and your dance shoes. Show up to enjoy a good time. On October 26th, our school will be having a blood drive. Contact Ms. Walditz for any open spots to help save a life. We want to congratulate Dusty Page and Clay Zeller on being named Kansas Scholars. All of your hard work has paid off, and you made LRHS proud. On October 10th, sleep in, because we don't have school that day. Thank you, Columbus. So, so what, what do you think about moving that? How does that, what, what do you think about that? Yo como los mocos. What? Yo como los mocos. What are you saying? <laughs> Yo como los mocos. <sighs> Sometimes don't you wish you had a translator? Well, we had that same problem here in the newsroom. With the school year just starting, I'm still not used to understanding exactly what my students are telling me. When I ask a question, now that I've hit 30, I don't understand a lot of the teen slang. But luckily, I have a couple students that are able to translate what my other students are telling me. So Brandon, I noticed you didn't have that last homework assignment done on time. How come? Uh, well, when I was driving home, my car was sputtering and I just didn't know what was going on and I was stranded out on the highway for at least a couple hours and I was really tired when I got home. It, it, it was pretty frustrating. Okay. Uh, you stayed up till midnight playing Minecraft. <laughs> Taylor, you look a little tired. How was your weekend? Oh, last night was, was lit, fam. I got 360 no scopes on some noobs. What he means is he stayed up until 4 a.m. last night versus a bunch of little six-year-old kids that have never played the game before. To each his own, I guess. So, Caleb, how's your school year going? Talking to any girls? Yeah, a couple. It's going pretty good. Good. Yeah, he's actually not talking to anybody. He's actually pretty sad about it. Why? Yes, <laughs> I am. It's like a couple of them. No. Yes, yes, it's going pretty good too. I've talked to them. No. Yes, I have. I've even made plans to meet up. No. It's okay. That's all for this week, Redskins. I'm Carson, and we'll see you in two weeks.